Infiltrate the facility. Okay. Yeah, this is definitely a controller game. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Because a Hotline Miami is like a keyboard mouse game. Oh. If you enter the light, you'll be seen. Keep to the shadows. Thank you. You shadow to stay hidden. Dude, I was playing... Uh, Wait, this is actually relevant. Um, last night... Well, not last night, but over the past couple days, I've been playing... Uh, I've been replaying Zelda Wind Waker. And uh, I, I kind of forgot... What? <gasps> okay, we're in combat now. I kind of forgot that that game... Okay. Hard punches. Okay, so X is punch, Y is kick. Can I do a roundhouse kick? Yeah, baby. I forgot that the first mission of that game is a stealth mission. Yeah, dude, this... I actually haven't played Sifu, although I'd really like to, but this basically is just Sifu combat. Like, the kind of light version of Sifu's combat from what I've seen. And yeah, a style meter. Defeat the guard. Okay, stop walking away from me! You're supposed to let me defeat you! When the guard's health reaches zero, defeat them with a heart attack. Hyah! Holy shit, that was awesome. <laughs> okay. Okay, okay. We're I'm, I'm happy about that. Looting guards. Once a guard is defeated, approach their body and press... Uh, looks like Y to loot. It gave me... Hello? Hello? Taser dart. Bro grabbed you and then just let you beat the shit out of him? Yeah. When, that, when they hired that guy, they were like, all right, you're going to be the tutorial enemy. <laughs> Under no circumstances are you allowed to fight back. <laughs> you picked up a taser dart. This item can be used to stun enemies or disable lights. Uh, How would I use this thing? Okay, it's RT. Well, I don't need to use it yet. Let's see. Uh, you, Yeah, yeah, yeah. Avoid being seen using the taser dart. Like, against this light? It kind of looks like I can just walk past it, but... Ooh, ooh, what? Okay. Okay, what do I do? And to fire. It says release. That's what I did. Oh, I have to, like, specifically target it. There it is. Okay, okay, okay. Little... Little clunky on the controls there, but... Guards will hear if you make too much noise. Approach the next guard silently. Oh, you can you can stealth. Where is he actually? I was like, I didn't even see him. Sneak attack, bitch! Okay, it takes out some of their health, it looks like. Initiating combat with a sneak attack deals tremendous damage and puts you at a significant advantage. Avoid enemy attacks by dodging? Which, with what? Hey, okay. I, I, I dodge! Oh, too early, okay. Oh, you're gonna, you're gonna punish me. Roundhouse kick me! Oh, stunned! Oh, I have to keep doing it, I see. Wait, am I, how am I not dodging it? Do I have to, like, actively iframe them? Too- how is that too early? <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck you! Not gonna make this easy on me, huh? Okay. Now I'm just gonna beat the shit out of you, okay? Parry enemies attacks to briefly stun foes instead of- okay, there's more. There's more tutorials. Too early. Ooh, the parry timing is kind of tight. I mean, I guess the dodge timing is too. I swear to God. <laughs> Fuck you. I'm doing it! <laughs> oh my God. There it is. Ugh! Attacks can be chained together for different effects. For example, if your third attack is a heart attack, it will launch an enemy into the air. You can juggle uh, launch enemies with quick attacks or send them with heart. Oh, that's cool. So wait, I could go like... Oh! Oh, get shit on! <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Okay, what was launch again? I, I don't think I'm doing this right. X, Y, X, Y, or, oh, X or Y. Wait, that's what I'm doing. Oh, I see. I, I was doing it right. <laughs> I was doing it right the first time. And then I gotta juggle them. Oh, and then you hold to send them. I feel like I'm doing this combo right. There it is. Yo, what's up, Shell Shock? Okay, I'm, I'm buffering like one too many punches here. I have to send them. I keep forgetting. I, I see you, red arrow. Okay, they don't stay in the air like even long enough for me to charge up an attack. There it is. <laughs> okay. Knocking guard into a wall will cause them to get stuck in a period of uh, for a period of time in a vulnerable wall splat state. I like that name. Use this opportunity to get in some heavy damage. Wall splat the guard. Ugh. Get friggin' wall splatted, bro. I like how now they're just not attacking anymore. Like, they could just periodically do attacks so I could practice by, like, dodging and parrying. I can't, like, seem to get you into the wall here. Into the wall. Okay, or just get closer to the wall. There's, I guess that counts. Right there. Get back towards the wall. Back towards the wall. There it is. Oh, you were splatted for such a short amount of time. And stay splatted. <laughs> Defeat the guard. Are they gonna start actually attacking again? Okay, yeah. Repeatedly using the same attack change uh, will cause guards to build up heat, allowing them to block inner. Okay, I see. What? Guards can regenerate health, health, uh, health over time, keep the pressure on them to prevent them from regaining health, or reduce their maximum health permanently by hitting them while they are launched, wall splatted, or dazed. Okay. What the fuck? Excuse me? Oh. Okay. There we go. Yeah, holding down the heavy attacks is, like, just a little bit awkward. I won't even lie. Also, I feel like the game volume is still quiet. What the fuck? Oh, here we go. <laughs> I'm just gonna go to 100%. Kinda of feel bad for the guard. <laughs> MF got beaten up for like five minutes straight. Yeah. Defeat the remaining guards. Can I? I can tase them, right? Yeah. Well, now. Uh oh. Oh, I should have been sneaking. <laughs> oh god, there's two! Oh shit, I hit the wrong button to parry. Okay, the nice thing is that there is, like, action canceling. Like, you can... You can stop an action to parry, like, pretty easily. I keep- I keep pressing B to dodge. It's like that Dark Souls muscle memory. I- uh, okay, do I have to be facing them to parry? I do like being able to, like, counter-parry them. Oh, okay. Oh, 
my god, I'm getting hit a lot. Okay, yeah, the parry is not too bad at all. Oh, oh, did you get splatted? Oh, did someone get splatted on the wall? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's pretty fun. Uh, what is this? You picked up a gadget. These unique consumables can be thrown for various effects. Toss an electromagnet to trap a guard in place. Press uh, RB to throw it at your feet or hold LB to aim it. Okay. What did you drop? Oh, a taser. <laughs> I was like, what? What did? It, what? Did, what was it? Objective: Collect the elevator access card. Descend to the next level in the elevator. Let's do it. Yeah, this is uh, this game is an alpha. Like I can tell, this game is gonna is gonna absolutely fuck when it's done. Um, and it, it's it, it's already good. It, it has some things that maybe need to be massaged a little bit, but I like it a lot. Okay, you've completed the tutorial. Now to put your skills to the test. If you have trouble, you can review the game systems and more. I won't have trouble. I'm already a god at this game. <laughs> I only got hit like 35 times in that last fight. Yeah, I think, uh, with a game like this, it's really gonna come down to, like, the polish of gameplay systems. And I'd say they're, like, 75% of the way there. But I'd rather have, like, all the- Ooh, he saw me. Okay. Alright, it's just one enemy, you know? How hard could it be? Ooh, that counted? Okay. I mean, I am beating the shit out of this enemy. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Yeah. <laughs> uh. Picked up some gear. These pieces of equipment can be worn for various effects. Honestly, my strategy so far is just uh, to max X, uh, to mash XXY, XXY. <laughs> and then just parry if I see a flash. And honestly, it's working. <laughs> These enemies have the health bar of a mini boss. I mean, they are armored, and I'm fighting them in in hand to hand combat. Oh fuck! Oh, they like patrol and shit. What? He's got a gun. Oh, it's a taser. Okay. I guess I can tase him. Oh, we game it. Oh. Nice try. <laughs> Wait, he killed me? Oh no, I killed him. Uh, that was weird. It like it looked like we reversed for a second. <laughs> All right. We will be using our stealth abilities. Oh fuck. God damn it. <laughs> it turned out what I actually needed the most help with was stealth all along. Oh, you're like up on- oh, okay. Okay, we're gonna fall? Alright, that's fine. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> uh... <laughs> is this like a roguelike? I guess I, I don't understand like how the progression of this game is going to work. Uh, the combat is, uh, is, is pretty fun, though. I can't lie. Alright, what, what, there's gotta be something I can do here, right? I can switch my gadget. Noisemaker, concussion grenade, or electromagnet. Does uh, electromagnet, like, stuns him, right? Or it's supposed to? Where did he go? Alright, never mind. Where did homie go? What's up, Shiko? We're playing Hotline Sifu right now. <laughs> and it's good. Okay, this guy. Oh, you're in class. 
But it didn't do anything! I was like finishing him with a with a big punch. Okay, can I like pick this back up? Are you shitting me? <laughs> okay, so they have to they have to walk like directly through it. How do I get out of this? Okay. <laughs> Congrats, you played yourself. Full face visor. Do I have like equipment or something? Oh, I do. Yeah, dude, equip all of it. Oh, wait, what is this? IMS detector? Sure. Gear me up. Oh, fuck. Run, 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 run! Ah, oh, fuck it. <laughs> I... There it is. It's really got to be right when their uh, baton is like about to make uh, contact with you. Oh, I died. <laughs> I died. Okay. No, 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 no. Run it back. Run it back. Run it back. Okay. Yeah, it is like a. It is like a roguelike. It seems like. Uh, gear. Uh huh. <laughs> All right, there's nothing I can do there, apparently. We'll give it one more try, and then I'll I'll move on to the next one. Yeah, it's a roguelike. Don't tell Dave. I kind of like the the fixed camera stuff too. It gets like a little awkward in uh, in combat, like the camera does. Although it's a little more dynamic there. Okay, I got an electromagnet. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna put it right there, because he like has to walk over it. Oh my god, it's hard to aim. Huh? Oh, I see, I see, okay. I... I got the last laugh there still, that was... Jesus Christ, I smoked him. <laughs> I guess the, electromag the electromagnet helped a lot. I feel like using equipment well is gonna be, uh the key to going far in this game. Yeah, it actually reminds me like ever so slightly of uh, of Risk of Rain. Okay, so I'm in the light here, which kind of loves. Oh, fuck. Who's this? Who's this? Oh. Tased me. All right. I'm sure the enemies get more complex, but I feel like they need, like, combos or something. Like, not just, like, single baton attacks. I I'm sure that's something that is, like, planned for the game, you know? Um, I don't have anything. But, like, for now, it feels like you get, like, insanely long windows to hit them, and then they get, like, no time to hit you. Get, get fucked, nerd! Wait, what? Oh, he must have just come unstunned. I also have, like, a, a, a tiny issue with the, um, with the parry and the dodge. I feel like you probably technically have more, like, more leniency with the dodge, but I died. Um, you probably technically have more leniency with the dodge, but it feels way more worth it to just always go for the parry. Like, I feel like the dodge maybe just needs, like, more frames, if that makes sense. That ended up being really short, so... 
Just do one more. He's just coming for me. Okay, I shouldn't have gone for that. Wow, I'm getting smoked now. <laughs> I'm getting smoked. Oh, I was doing so well before. What happened? They they just they they patched the game to be harder. The parry timing is like pretty unforgiving, but I kind of felt like I was getting the hang of it and then uh and then that happened and I just got smoked every time I tried to parry. It is nice being able to get to get a hit in. I think the fights are supposed to be feast or famine, though. Um, like, I think they want you to, like, stun and juggle the enemies and stuff. I, I swear to God, I, I beg to differ, game. Um, all right, grab the key card. I guess the key card is the way to, to the next level. So maybe we shouldn't be, like, trying to force fights with every enemy. Maybe we should just be trying to get to the exit. Although, it seems like the loot can actually be really useful. Because it's either equipment or, like, gear. Which, no, I didn't pick up any. I, I'm having a real good time with this, though. Um... Oh, fuck, they saw me. Oh, God, is it two of them? Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, no. Not the taser guy. <laughs> oh, this is an evil combo. And in this, like, close of quarters, too. Have you snuck past a single enemy yet? I I actually don't think sneaking past enemies is the point. Th this level doesn't even feel like it's designed for you to like be able to sneak past enemies. But here, we'll try a we'll try a stealth run here. Like they have they have super big like cones of vision. I think it's mainly just that you're supposed to try to get the upper hand on them by like stunning them or something like that. Um, which actually does help a lot. But, like, when you look at the positions of lights on this level, like, how the hell are you actually supposed to sneak past an enemy? Okay, we got- we took a little health off that guy. Dude, I don't know what you're- I guess you dodged the taser, probably, huh? <laughs> okay. Well, it's fun. I like it. I think that game will be will be quite cool when it's uh, when it's all said and done. Um, all right, so that was raw metal. Enjoyed it. Uh, cool combat. Cool concept. Um, and I'm excited to see uh, how the all the roguelike systems and stuff come together.